got four minutes, then stop using the excuse that you haven't got time to work out. In this video, I'm gonna give you a simple framework that allows you to squeeze as much juice into those four minutes as possible. And if you've got a bit more time, then stick around. I'll show you how that can be done as well. All right, number one, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go onto your phone and you're gonna look up either on your Spotify, Apple playlist or YouTube and go and find something called Tabata Songs, right? It's a playlist. When you go into Tabata Songs, it's literally a four minute track that's gonna count you in and count you out using this framework. So Tabata is 20 seconds of hard work, 10 seconds of rest, 20 seconds of hard work, 10 seconds of rest, repeated for a total of four minutes. Okay, so now you know the framework. Now you don't need a timer because you can literally press play and over the top of the Rocky soundtrack or whatever song you select, you can get to work. Okay, next thing you're going to do is pick your allocation of time. So are you going to do four? Are you going to do eight? Are you going to do 16? Again, depends on your level of fitness, depends on the amount of time available, but you can use this as a way to mix things up. So the same, you don't have to do the same round. You can, again, change out the exercises to give it a little bit more flexibility and fun as well all right now the next thing you're going to do is going to decide are you going to do one exercise all the way through you're going to do two exercises back to back which you can go from one to the other are you going to do four exercises so effectively you're going to go around that circuit twice because you're going to be doing eight rounds or are you going to be doing eight exercises now only thing i would recommend is if you're doing eight then do that in a group setting because it can get a little bit confusing you don't really need to go up to eight. I think four is the max I'd go to as an individual. If you're doing it in a group setting, obviously the more because you can spread out and you can create different stations. Okay, so now you've selected what you're going to do. My personal preference is doing two back to back. Sometimes I'll do four. That's the flow that I typically do. Now you're going to pick your exercises that you're going to follow. So again, I'll give you a few burpees, mountain climbers, planks, these are exercises that are also going to challenge your body. And again, you want to make sure that it's increasing your cardiovascular output. So again, getting your heart rate elevated. You don't want to pick something that's nice and simple that you can do at a pace. This is about speed and really accelerating, increasing your heart rate. Okay, so think of things that you can do that are going to get your heart rate up. Battle ropes, medicine ball slams, all of those. By the way, if you want to see a list of top my top 20 exercises just comment 20 exercises below this video i'll send you the list and you can literally pick from the list that is it that is all so again you may do one round four minutes of work and that's it if you're not working out right now and you're telling yourself i haven't got time that is bs and what i would encourage you to do is go okay i've over the average of the last three months i've worked out zero Therefore, I would encourage you to start out with one round of Tabata this week. All right, that's it. So it's that small. You cannot say no. You cannot say I haven't got four minutes in my diary. Wake up early, go to bed later, whatever it takes to squeeze in four minutes. Do it at your desk right now. Just if your boss is about, just tell him you're following this video and you're encouraging people to move more. There we go. So again, you have my permission. <laughs> Have an amazing day. If you got value from this bit video, smash the share button, pay it forward. Take care.